This is the story of Tyrion Lannister from Game of Thrones seasons 1 through 5 in 3 minutes. Let's begin. Born a dwarf whose mother dies in childbirth, Tyrion Lannister grows up despised by his older sister Cersei and his father Tywin. His only respite from his family's disgust is the condolences of his older brother Jaime, who does not hold Tyrion's deformity against him. Tyrion goes on to become well-versed in the art of political strategy, choosing to educate himself rather than attempt battle. At the age of 16, he marries a prostitute, who his father Tywin convinces to abandon him. Tywin reveals that the prostitute was actually hired by Jaime to give Tyrion some company, and that their marriage was a sham. Tyrion continues to grow with a newfound hatred of his father, and his nephew Joffrey, the sadistic and evil product of Jaime and Cersei's incestuous relationship. After the death of the King of Westeros, Tyrion is accused of attempted murder by the Stark family, while his brother remains their prisoner. Tyrion is held on trial, but is freed and returns to his family. He meets a prostitute named Shay, and the two fall in love. He is given the position of the Hand of the King in service to his nephew Joffrey, and serves as his political advisor. As Tyrion's relationship with Shay and his family blossoms, he develops a friendship with Sansa Stark, an unwilling guest of the courts. Tyrion proves to be invaluable to Joffrey, as he leads the battle against Stannis for the protection of King's Landing in the Battle of Blackwater. Despite his heroism, Tyrion is not given credit for his leadership. Joffrey is set to wed Marjorie Tyrell, and Tyrion is ordered to marry Sansa. The two wed, but do not consummate the marriage. Shay believes Tyrion is falling in love with Sansa, though Tyrion dismisses her. Joffrey is poisoned and killed, but accuses Tyrion before his death. Tyrion is put on trial for Joffrey's assassination, and is betrayed by those he trusted on the court. He reveals to the public his role in the Battle of Blackwater, but receives no reward. He requests a trial by combat, but the fighter he chooses to fight for him is killed. Jaime releases Tyrion from prison to save his life. Tyrion finds Shay sleeping with his father and murders both of them. Now on the run, Tyrion flees across Westeros to find Daenerys Targaryen with hopes to create a personal alliance. While on the journey, he becomes an alcoholic due to the nature of the stress he encountered from the trial. He is kidnapped by Daenerys' exiled right-hand man and effectively delivered to her. Tyrion uses his past experience as the Hand of the King to become Daenerys' new advisor, and together they discuss the best means in recapturing the throne of Westeros. Daenerys believes that she will receive support from the common people, though Tyrion fears her control of the Iron Throne could lead to a massive rebellion from the lower court. The two attend a fighting tournament, but the games are ambushed. In an attempt to save her own life, Daenerys calls upon her dragon and flies away. Tyrion is left behind, unaware Daenerys is gone. He assembles a small team to track down her location, but decides to stay and rule the land of Marine in her place. And that's Tyrion's life in three. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. I know these in three videos are short, just like Tyrion. I'd like to ask you guys a question. Are you excited for Game of Thrones season six? I know I am.